Welcome to Happiness is Healthy. This is Stephanie Serens, your happiness enhancer. How are you doing today? I'm having a wonderful day. You're doing good? That's fabulous. I'm glad you found a reason to create happiness in your heart today. Well, today I thought we'd talk about manifesting on Monday. Yeah, Manifestation Monday. So, as you can see behind me, there's some, a body of water that's called Fuller Lake, <laughs> and that's where I live now. Um, that's why I haven't been doing a few videos since April, because we were in the middle of moving and then summer art shows and creating, and uh, so we've been really busy, and we moved Robert's dad into an assisted care home. Yeah, but what I wanted to talk about is manifesting, because here... Um, when you need a place to live, like a lot of us do here in British Columbia, Canada, what do you do when you need a place to live? Well, when Robert and I needed a place to live, we did our best to manifest. What's manifest? You probably hear that word a lot. Well, I like to keep things simple, because that's what works for me, keeping it simple. And so, what I do to manifest is I create an image in my mind of what I wanted. And before we um, had this place to live at Fuller Lake Park, we really needed a house. So I was like, come on, angels, I really need some cheaper rent. Come on now, give me some really cheap rent. Ridiculously cheap rent, I said. I really need some ridiculously cheap rent. Because rent here, we were looking at $1,400, $1,550 a month, and, um, and some of them weren't even that nice. Yeah, so how do you manifest a place? So, that's what I did. And then we looked at a place on Fuller Lake, and it was going to be for $2,400, and we were going to split it with a friend, but that had two kitchens. So it was a beautiful, big, newer house, so that would have been all right, uh, but we didn't get chosen. So... But manifesting, so we just kept on holding the light. Robert kept on holding, I want to live at Fuller Lake, I want to live at Fuller Lake. And I kept on going, come on, some ridiculously cheap rent in a really nice house that was new and free of mold. And, um, and it needed to be electric and not be too new, but just be new enough where everything's off-gassed. And so a friend said, hey, why don't you apply for this job at Fuller Lake Park? And so I did. And so, to make a long story short, I got hired where, at a job that comes with a house, and the job almost pays for the house. So in a way, we do have ridiculously cheap rent for a really nice house that was just built in 2011. So I just want to remind you that the next time that you need to move, just keep on holding the light of what you want, no matter what it is. Just keep the vision and know that what you're going to get is exactly going to be perfect for you. Because this is the most perfect spot for Robert and I ever. We're the happiest we've ever been. And we have a little house up there. I'll turn you around. And may, uh, the light's going to be pretty bright. So, uh... I don't think it will work very good, actually, with the way filming goes. But anyways, I will show you that. Maybe tomorrow we'll walk around the property as a little and show you what we manifested. But I just want to say, you know, manifesting is holding, the, one is holding the vision of what you want in your mind without knowing when you're going to get it, just what you want. We wanted a safe place in a clean environment uh, with no steps, and a good driveway, and we got all those things. And so really be clear on what you want of your vision. And then after you have a clear vision, then just hold in your heart the faith that you're going to get the perfect thing for you. When people say, oh, it's so hard to get a house, I said, ah, oh, nah, I know the perfect house is going to come for me because you know what? I need a house, and I'm on earth. So the universe must have a really good spot for me because that's what I need, a really good spot. And I have a ton of fresh air, which is really important to me. And I can hear a lot of animal sounds sometimes. We have a lot of geese on the lake some days. <laughs> that's why it's closed right now, too much goose poop. But anyway, that's a whole nother story. But manifesting, 
hold your vision, keep the faith, that's another thing, and just realize that, and then manifest the feeling like you already have the, the perfect spot. And say thank you, universe, for the perfect spot. Not, I want a spot, I want, then you're wanting. No, have the fulfillment, I have the fulfillment of a spot, and just create that feeling I have a safe space on the planet. I have a safe space on the planet to live. Create that feeling of a safe space, and then the universe will give you the perfect home like it gave my husband Robert and I. So keep the faith, one. Um, keep visualizing the perfect thing, and then keep on telling yourself and uh, the universe, thank you, and hold an attitude of gratitude. And I think that's the best thing, because everything on the planet, flowers, animals, we just grow and want to do our best. So just do your best where you're planted, and then I bet the universe will give you an even more groovy place to transplant yourself, if that's what you need. So hold the vibe that it's all good, and then the universe can bring you more good. That's the tricky thing creating the emotion of the having a good day, even when maybe, you know, some things are happening that really aren't uh, that easy to deal with, right? But just keep on seeing the outcome that you want, no matter the, what the physical reality says. Because we create by holding a vision. That's not reality. A vision in our mind, that's just in... The land of vision, whatever you want to call that. In the land of the psyche, in the land of the mind, and in the heart. So just hold your vision. Believe you can have it. Take some deep breaths so you can keep patient. And just see your dream unfold. Co-create what you want. By just keep on asking and saying thank you. Telling the universe a detailed list. Thank you for the perfect house. Thank you for the perfect job. Thank you for the perfect mate. Whatever you're trying to manifest. Thank you for the perfect me. Yeah, how do I be the perfect me so I can draw to me the life that I'm dreaming of? So keep dreaming for the perfect life and keep enhancing your happiness. I love you. Have a great day. Thanks.